what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Carolina Panthers quarterback Cam Newton apologized to the female reporter and women all over the world for the sexist comments that he made directed toward her on Wednesday. But now the reporter herself has apologized. For what one might ask? Well, turns out that this reporter had a certain fondness for racial epithets. She likes racial jokes. Her father, she said, is a racist. And while on a trip, she was tweeting to, I guess, a friend or follower on Twitter, and she was laughing about how great her father's racist jokes are. Yeah. Who is this person, you one might ask? Charlotte Observer reporter Jordan Rodriguez. Now, she posted the apology on Twitter. And this was an apology for three tweets that she had tweeted three, four, five years ago. In two of the tweets, Rodriguez referenced laughing at racial jokes. In the third, she used the word nigga. That might explain her vitriol for Cam Newton because, yes, the remarks were sexist. But she really, really went in. I mean, she's covering football and not making an excuse for it, but from time to time, people are gonna ride that line. The players are gonna ride that line. I felt like she was being a little over the top, melodramatic. She's like, ah, you're not gonna stop me from doing my job. I felt like, hey, you're a beat reporter for the Carolina Panthers. Cam Newton is their biggest star. You might want to try to have a decent relationship with him so that you can have access to the star player. So how did we get here? Jordan Rodriguez asked Cam Newton a question during his media day appearance. And Cam Newton smirked and said, it's funny hearing a woman talk about football routes. So everybody went crazy. Oh, it's sexist. He lost uh, a couple of uh, endorsement deals. The feminists came waving the flag, going crazy. He's a sexist. See that? You had the men jumping up from all walks of life, defending her. Ah, yeah, you know, poor Jordan, poor Jordan. Poor Jordan. And then all of a sudden, this black sports media outlet went to digging. It went through her tweets and found some old tweets. And that's how they discovered that old Jordan Rodriguez was a classic closet racist. Her and her daddy. This is what she said in her fake apology. I apologize for the offensive tweets from my Twitter account from four or five years ago. There is no excuse for these tweets and the sentiment behind them. I am deeply sorry and apologize that I got caught. I hate them damn niggers digging in my shit. Fuck niggers. <laughs> okay, she ended at I am deeply sorry and apologize. So let me get this straight. It's funny to laugh at racist jokes, but it's not okay to think that it's funny that a woman is asking a football related question. The hypocrisy of these people is amazing. The hypocrisy. 
the fake outrage. Oh man, they lost their mind. They act like the dude had raped somebody, like he killed somebody. He lost endorsement deals and all kinds of shit. Had his name dragged. Now, since this revelation about these racist tweets, she's kind of gone under the radar. Nobody's really saying anything about her. Not even the feminist sites who dragged Cam Newton. They're not really talking about it. What's that about? I'll tell you what it's about. The feminist sites are doing the bidding of white supremacy, just like many other people who came out and attacked dude off the rip, all white supremacists. They feel the same way. They're racist. That's why they didn't attack her the way they did Cam. In fact, they didn't attack her at all. A lot of them, quiet as a mouse. Again, I'm not defending Cam Newton. I'm speaking, I'm defending righteousness. That's all it is to me. When I line up Cam Newton's sexist remarks and Jordan Rodriguez's racist remarks, ain't none of them shit to me. So the bottom line for me Fuck both of them. No more talk. Wonder what the haters talking about. Yeah. Order, Texas.